Manchester United withdraw from the European Super League. Welcome to Rokani Sports and please subscribe to our football news channel. Joel Glazer and his siblings have suffered an embarrassing defeat as Man United choose to leave the Super League two days after confirming their involvement. Manchester United have withdrawn from the Super League just two days after their co-chairman Joel Glazer trumpeted the condemned concept. In an embarrassing climb down from the club, United have followed Manchester City and Chelsea in departing the breakaway league after widespread backlash from supporters, football figures, and politicians across the continent. Manchester United confirmed their withdrawal along with Tottenham, Liverpool, and Arsenal at 10.55 p.m. on Tuesday. A United statement read, We have listened carefully to the reaction from our fans, the UK government and other key stakeholders. We remain committed to working with others across the football community to come up with sustainable solutions to the long-term challenges facing the game. The news comes after Ed Woodward, the club's executive vice chairman, resigned on a fraught night in United's modern history. Manchester United's swift exit from the doomed competition represents a victory for their supporters, who had planned on a mass protest against their involvement in their forthcoming fixtures against Leeds United and Liverpool. T will also increase pressure on the ownership of the Glazer family, who have suffered an ignominious defeat amid plans to leave the Champions League, a competition United have a rich history in. Joel Glazer, the United co-chairman, was one of three figures quoted in the Super League announcement on Sunday night and was listed among the co-chairmen. Bruno Fernandes, Marcus Rashford and Luke Shaw all denounced the Super League in posts on social media. What's your take on Manchester United's withdrawing from the European Super League? Leave your opinion in the comment section below. Thank you for watching in Rokani Sports.